your JetFind account is automatic. Sign in with your Malloy email credentials. This allows you to save items and searches. Turn on notifications to receive email alerts when a new item meets your search parameters. Go to My Favorites to check your saved items and saved searches. At any time, you can check your searches and enable or disable alerts and remove them from your favorites. You can place unique identifiers like DOI, PMID, or ISBN directly into the JetFind search box. If we have it, you will see the database or collection we have access through. If it appears that we do not have the item, you can expand the search beyond Jet Library, and this will allow you to request the item through Interlibrary Loan, There are two options when looking at citation trails. Find sources citing this and find sources cited in this. Please note that these lists may not be complete. Do not worry about falling down a rabbit hole and losing your place, however because JetFind will keep track of your citation path so you know what you clicked on. Librarians set up recommendations using simple search terms. They can be a JetFind search, a LibGuide, a database, or a website. In this first example for textbook, you see that it suggested a JetFind search for the physical textbook collection. The second suggestion is a LibGuide, the Open Educational Resource Guide, which does discuss textbooks. The third example, when searching for Bates, will suggest the database. Other recommendations could include a website or librarian. The Chat with a Librarian button in JetFind lets you get assistance while staying in your JetFind search. The newest JetFind feature is Report an Issue. This appears as a little bug icon in the lower right on a desktop or in the menu bar on a mobile device. You have four options, broken link, odd search behavior, accessibility barrier, or other. Please include a brief description of the issue and your Malloy email address. As a bonus, the permanent link for whatever JetFind page you are looking at will be included in this report to a librarian. Don't forget to click Submit.